Good morning everybody. I'm in bed, obviously. I should be up by now. It's 10 o'clock. I'm just about to go in the shower and wash my tan off. You probably can't tell right now, but my tan is major this morning. So I'm gonna go wash the top layer off and wash my hair at the same time. My hair hasn't been washed in four days, which for me is so long. <sighs> I had my hair blow dried the other day. I didn't wash it for that, I just wet it so like I didn't put shampoo or anything in it. So I'm excited to give it a wash. I've honestly had the nicest couple of days ever. Yesterday, quite honestly, was just a chill day. I just thought, you know what, just chill out today. So I did, but the day before that, I went to this amazing hotel with Hannah. I'm not gonna tell you too much about it because you'll see that vlog probably tomorrow, but that was so much fun, I had the best night. And I've just been editing that video. So far it's taken me like seven hours. I had an hour and a half of footage somehow, but it's got down to like 15 minutes, which is good. That's just because I filmed little clips on two cameras, so I had to like sort out the angles and stuff. I really like that vlog. Oh, I need to get up anyway. I also need to stop sleeping in my nice white bed in when I've just fake tanned. But I just can't sleep in the other room. I can't get to sleep in there. I feel like there's no air in it. Like I can't explain it. It feels really stuffy. But this room feels like really airy. Oh guys, I'm tired. Oh. My plan today is that I'm going to Primark I think. And I'm going to go have a little look. See what they've got. Then hope hopefully film a Primark haul. I need a couple more videos for when I go on holiday, but I'm just so stuck for ideas. But I know that Primark have got some new summer stuff in, so I'm really excited because I can get some stuff for my holiday and also some new summery stuff for my house, hopefully. So I'm gonna head there straight after my shower. Not gonna bother with makeup or anything, so I'm gonna film that when I get back. So that's the plan for today. Okay, I'm gonna jump straight in the shower and start getting ready before I do anything else. Oh, hello light. Oh my god, you know when you've been sat in the dark and then you look at the light and it's like, oh. Uh. I really don't know what mode to have my camera on. I keep like flipping modes. The one before was called Super Auto or something and this is just called Auto. But also there's the movie one. But I feel like in my vlog that's coming up, some parts have looked really grainy. And I think I might have been on the movie mode and I might have just had the ISO too high. This is movie mode. And it's probably the most like what I actually look like right now. It doesn't like brighten it, so you have to brighten it yourself, which means it goes grainy. But yeah, I'm looking tanned. I can hear Nelly meowing, bless him. I also washed my brushes yesterday, so I'm feeling really productive. I love these rails. It's meant for towels, but it's so good for brushes. Yay, I've now got a full pot of clean brushes. I don't know whose brush this is. It's either George's or Hannah's, so whoever's it is, claim it. Before I straighten this bushy hair, I am just deciding what to have for breakfast. And I think I'm gonna go the healthier route today and have some granola. So I've got this Jordan's Crunchy Oat Granola, the fruit and nut one, it's the nicest thing ever. Looks like this, it's got like dried fruit bits in and banana and raisins. Definitely in my top three cereals. So I'm just gonna have that with some almond milk. Mmm. Look how frizzy my hair is before I've straightened it. Ugh. Yum. I'm gonna eat this, then straighten my hair, then go to Primark. Hello guys, it's Gabby, reporting from iPad Mini. I'm locked in my bedroom. <laughs> the handle just won't work. It's just like, stopped. This is not even funny. I don't have anybody's numbers on my iPad. I don't have my landlord's number. I don't have my neighbor's number, but I don't want to disturb her because she's just had a newborn baby. And none of my family are answering FaceTime. And do you want to know the worst part? My lip balm is downstairs. <laughs> and also my phone is downstairs. I mean, that could have saved me right now, but I'm locked in my room. <laughs> I only came up for my moisturizer, which I've got. Help. <laughs> Nelly. I'm gonna show you what happens. Look at this bit in here. This iPad is also on 20% battery. <laughs> I think I'm a bit screwed to be honest. Can't even jump out the window because it's like a roof window. Strangers down below. <laughs> oh my God, I'm stuck. 
Oh my god, I've just put a bit of moisturiser on my face because I was getting a bit dry from the stress. <laughs> so I'm sorry if I look really, um, shiny. But my dad just talked me through getting out of my room. I had a pair of scissors in my room. So I literally went in the lock and like moved it and I got free. I've got hiccups as well. I've got stress hiccups. What a day to be alive. That was radical. <laughs> Nothing like that's ever happened to me before. I honestly didn't know what to do because all my London friends are on holiday. Not that they could help me anyway because they don't have a key but like Hobby's in Brazil. Evan's in Florida. I didn't have my landlord's number on my iPad. <laughs> So I couldn't contact him. Oh my god, what a stressful time. Anyways, I'm out. Now I'm gonna go to Primark. <laughs> Yippee! Okay, I'm off now. I need to stop wearing this Nike top. Actually, no, I don't. Why do I need to stop wearing this Nike top? I just always think I wear things a lot, but that's because I like it. That doesn't mean that I need to stop wearing it. If I like it, I like it. <laughs> this is like my kind of casual chilling out outfit. Oh my god, look at this picture of Nell. Oh, it's the cutest little thing ever. Can't remember what I was even saying. I was probably just rambling about liking things. But yeah, I've just put this top on, my leather jacket, my little bag, which I actually attached the pom-pom to it. It looks really yellow here, but it's not. It's actually like creamy. I think that looks well cute. So thank you to whoever in the comments of my video said, put the pom-pom on your bag. Because I have and I like it. But yeah, I've just got my cards, my phone, some mints and some lip balm. Got my sunglasses on my head, these are Miu Miu. I'm gonna head off to Primark now, so I will see you in a bit. Bye now, Bobs. See you later. Look how cute this bag is. It's so cute. Okay, bye. I love that I can just go out now with like no makeup or anything and not feel completely self-conscious. That's so nice. It's such a nice day today as well. It's like sunny, but it's not hot. What have you guys been up to today? Let me know in the comments. Still find it awkward vlogging in public. Oh my God, it's gone cold now. Oh. goodness I am back got some pink cheeks going on I've got two massively heavy Primark bags and once I'd paid for everything I was just like oh I'm just gonna get an uber back then I was like you know what Gabs man the f up and walk home <laughs> so I got two tubes because the line on one of my tubes is broken like I can normally get from Tottenham Court Road straight back to mine but one of them has stopped going to mine so I have to get off it Camden and change which is fine but oh my god my poor hands look at them ow it also started raining right when I got off the tube and I had a 10 minute walk home and I was like no so I've just washed my hair today obviously oh geez I need to sit down oh my god guys I bought a cap how funny I also bought this bomber it's so nice. I got it in pink as well. I do prefer the pink one. But I feel like this, when I've got like makeup on, with the khaki green hat. I mean, some of you will probably think I look like a farmer, but I kind of dig it. So this is my new vibe, everybody. Farmer Gabs at your service. Right, I'm gonna film a massive Primark haul. I bought so much stuff. I think it came to 180 pounds, which is crazy, but I honestly got so much stuff. Like if you divided that by the number of things that I got, it'd probably be like four pounds per thing. And I got loads of clothes and stuff for on holiday. So I've got a massive whack off Primark haul to film. <sighs> I'm worn out. Right everybody, I'm back all comfy in my pyjamas. Just for a little while, I'm cooking myself some food because I need to eat something. And I thought that I would show you my PO box stuff. So I've got it all lined up on the table. And I'm gonna start out with these. These are the new Barry M Coconut Infusion Nail Paints. And this color is stunning. I wanna put this on right now. This is in the shade Surfboard. It's such a pretty dusky pink. This one is in the shade Bikini, it's like a mint. This is Laguna, this is so nice as well. The next one is Flamingo, Aloha. This is Skinny Dip, 
This one is Tiki Hut. This is Sunkiss. And the last one is called Starfish. They are such nice colours. They're like really muted aside from, I'd say these two. I mean, that will look a little bit brighter on as well, but it won't look too bright. I love these colours so much. I think I'm going to paint my nails with that one right now. What are you doing? You be naughty, aren't you? Look at him, he just bites everything. The next thing is a Barry M Illuminating Strobe Cream. And I'm assuming this is just like a highlighter. That looks really pretty. I've just put this on my hand. I don't know if you can see it. And it's really nice and glowy. So that would be a really nice highlighter, I reckon. I like that. Next, we've got a Radiance Rod highlighter. I'm not sure what that one does. I'm gonna guess that one. I mean, you could probably use that on your cheekbones, but that'd be a really nice inner corner eye highlight. And then this is a Light Me Up liquid highlighter, which looks really nice as well. Oh, there's another shade of the strobe cream as well. This one's a more goldy one. They look so nice. I love highlighters so much. So these are right up my street. I've got some eyeliners from Makeup Forever. These are the Aqua XL liners. These are actually incredible. I've already got a black one, I think. Or I've got a black one of their other eyeliners, and it's incredible. I'm sure these are going to be for summer, like waterproof as well. So they're cool. I'm going to try them out. I've got a hand chemistry retin oil, hand boosting oil for scars, stretch marks, aging, and dehydrated skin. So it says it's proven to offer the same results as prescription only drug retin A without the irritating effects or necessary prescription. So I'm pretty sure you can use this everywhere that looks really cool next up i've got these paint can nail polish from nails inc and i've actually tried the silver and the pink ones and they are so 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 good so they've got porchester square which is such a nice color they've got mayfair market and west end and what you do is you basically use the base coat spray it on and then put the put this on top again to seal it in. Then you wash your hands and that's literally your manicure done. So I'll show you this in use when I've grown my nails. They are disgusting right now. They're so good though. I forgot to say, I also got a phone charger with the Barry M um, nail things, but you've probably seen this everywhere because so many YouTubers have posted about it. Right then, on to Makeup Forever. This is the Makeup Forever Artist Acrylic. It's a liquid satin lip thing. This is really, really, really cool. It's such a bright pink colour. I've then got the Artist Lip Balm, which is just a really pale pink. And I've also got the Artist Lip Blush. This looks incredible. It literally looks like the colour I would wear all the time. So it's on my hand at the top. How pretty is that? Oh my gosh. So thank you Makeup Forever for those. I'm really excited to try these actually. I love lip products. I've also been sent this from Amazing Cosmetics. It's the Amazing Cosmetics Perfection Stick Cover and Contour on the go. This would definitely be more of a contour shade for me. But it just looks like this and you can cover up with it and contour like it says. So that looks wicked. There's a little swatch of that underneath the highlighter. That's going to be such a good contour shade. Then moving on to Kiko. I've got so much stuff from Kiko. This is the Desert Moon Highlighter. And it looks like this. It looks a lot like a highlighty blush shade. Oh my god, that's so pretty. Can you see that at the bottom of my hand? That is so pretty. I'm going to try that out today. I've also got a foundation type product. And this comes with a little sponge in the top and a mirror. So I'm going to give this a go as well. I'm not sure if it's my shade, but I'll try it anyway for the formula. I think they've sent me two shades. This is actually a wet and dry powder foundation, but I think it'll work for me as kind of a bronzer. And then this one's the cream foundation. I've also got a lip base. I'm not sure what this does. Oh, it says it neutralizes the lip tone and enhances the lipstick color. So a bit like a primer for your lips. And I've got one of these invisible lip liners. They basically just stop any lipstick from bleeding. This is a heat wave lip oil. This looks so nice. I imagine this to be like them YSL ones. And the last thing I've got is an eyeliner pen, which looks like this. That looks wicked actually. I've just swatched it on the bottom of my hand and it's so pigmented. And then I've also been sent this little trio. So this is a baked blush. This looks incredible as well. I've already had a little peek. Look at that. That looks amazing. And then there's a lip color, which is such a gorgeous color too. Look at that shade. Oh, I love this packaging. It's like magnetic. And I've also got a mascara too. 
That looks so nice. Another thing is the Cloud Skin Solution Skin Rehab Scar Minimizing Cream. I'm pretty sure I've been sent this from my weight loss video for my scars, so I will try this out and see how it works, but thank you for that. I was actually gonna buy one of these the other day, but I'm so glad I didn't, because I went to my PO box and the first thing I saw was this, and I was like, oh my God, I'm so excited. So this is, it's like a water bottle, but you can put whatever you want in. The straw just does that and comes out. And on the back, it's got times. So it shows you how much you should be drinking between hours. How amazing is that for somebody like me who is a really bad drinker. This is gonna be so handy. This is from Hydrate Mate. And the last thing I've been sent is from Charlie Mortley Design. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. There's all her details there. And this is some artwork, which I think is gorgeous. It's got like copper arrows on it. I absolutely love this. So thank you so much. And thank you to every brand who's sent me things. I honestly can't, can't wait to try everything. I'll be doing another first impression kind of video on my main channel, so look out for that. And I will try a bunch of this stuff. But yeah, thank you so much. I'm very, very grateful. Hello everybody. I've now done my makeup. I've been too busy face swapping with celebrities on Snapchat to actually film my video. So now I've got to film my video and it is currently about half past seven. So I'm hoping that I can get done with my video by half past eight. I've still got to do my hair and everything and get ready. But I really hope I'm done by half past eight because I'm going back to Sheffield tomorrow and I'm getting like the half three train or something. So I don't really want to go to bed too late tonight because I've got some stuff to do before tomorrow and also I've got to edit this vlog and stuff. I'm sorry if this vlog's been crap by the way. I don't know why but I haven't really been in the mood to vlog today, like not fully. Like some days I'm so good at vlogging and all I want to do is just like talk. But today I'm just not feeling it. I'm not even really fe feeling filming this video right now but I've got ready so I'm going to. Okay, I'm gonna take all my Primark stuff upstairs, get set up, put my extensions in, find something to wear. I've just put the washer on, so hopefully all of my stuff will be okay for me to pop in my suitcase tonight, so I can pack my suitcase tonight. I'm meant to be going for some blood tests tomorrow, because as you probably know, I went to the doctors, and she's sending me for blood tests to be tested for like, so much stuff so I really do need to go and do that in the morning so I do need to get stuff done tonight I also wanted to film another video tomorrow oh my gosh I'm uploading so much on my main channel which is so good but also it's meant that a lot of the videos that I film for when I'm on holiday I'm like already putting up like a stupid woman so I'm like running low on videos for my holiday so I now need to film a load more which is so bad I'm so stupid but yeah I need to go film this video Okay, bye. Just about to film my video and I've literally got two massive piles of stuff. I bought so much. I've tried it all on though and I already know that a few things are gonna go back and I need different sizes in some stuff. But I got so much stuff. I'm just trying to decide what to wear. I think I might wear a top that I bought from Primark in this video because obviously that would make sense. But I need to put my hair in and everything. <gasps> this monster's come to join. Which means you're going to be all over this stuff in a minute, aren't you? Because you're nosy. This is what Nelly does just when I start filming. Starts crinkling in a bag. Hello! <laughs> Hi guys! I've just finished filming one video. I'm in all pink and white stripes. I've got this top on, then I've got this like dressing gown thing on. It's so cute. I feel like a Victoria's Secret model right now. I've decided to refilm a video that I filmed the other day because the lighting was horrendous in it, like horrendous. My background literally looked blue slash gray. It was so weird. So I'm gonna just refilm that now, which is so annoying because I've actually edited it and uploaded it to YouTube, ready and waiting for me to set it live, but that's just life. I'm a massive perfectionist and I just can't deal with that stuff, so I'm just gonna do it again. My cheeks are getting really red though. I don't even have blush on right now. Hi guys. Look I'm at it. I'm you what I'm gonna take. In why is it blue? I'm glad you all liked this video with Hobby, by the way. So I'm just getting my airplane bag ready again. I don't go for another nine days, I think. But like I said, I'm pre-filming videos for when I'm on holiday. And this one should go on the day I go on holiday or the day after. So it might go up on the 4th of May. Anyways, I need to get cracking. It is currently quarter to 10. <laughs> and I've got to edit this vlog, edit my Hey You vlog that'll be up possibly tomorrow actually, whenever it's the 26th. Yeah, 
That'll be up tomorrow. Oh my god, you'll get to see mine and Hannah's fun sleepover tomorrow. That's so cool. It was honestly so much fun. So I'm so excited for you to see that vlog because I put loads of effort into it as well. I used two different cameras and I don't know, it's just cute. It's a nice little memory to have. So let me know if you're looking forward to tomorrow's vlog. And I'm gonna get cracking filming this video or I never will. <laughs> See you in a bit. Also changing this lip colour. Get off my lips, Kylie Lip Kit. Oh my god, guys. If anyone knows, I'm not gonna put her on notifications again and stuff. But if you know when Kylie Jenner's bringing out more like putting more on sale can you let me know because i really want to get a backup of coco k for myself because i just wear it all the freaking time and i also want to get another one to give away to you guys so if you can let me know on twitter when kylie's going to be putting up more lip kits so i can get one for you yeah that would be great okay i'm gonna go now bye that was actually really helpful for taking this off this is growth don't put this in the vlog gabs it ain't cute. And I've done. Coco K is literally the same colour as my lips. Like, they're too pink now because I've been rubbing it off. But it's literally the same colour as my natural lips. I'm putting true brown on now, though. Peace. Okay, guys. It's now 11 o'clock. I'm tired. But I need to eat something. I know it sounds like a stupid time to eat, but... I need to eat something. I feel like I'm gonna pass out. So I'm just gonna make myself a soup and I'm gonna edit, oh God, I've got this vlog to edit for tomorrow, another vlog to edit for tomorrow. And the only problem with that is that I really wanted to go to Primark in the morning and take some stuff back and exchange sizes, but also I've got to get to the train station for 3 p.m. as well, pack my suitcase and everything, get my tickets and then go home to Sheffield. I got an early a train normally I would go like after rush hour but this time I'm going before I don't really know what to do I've got so much I feel like I've got so much to do but I also don't want to stay up late tonight by late I mean like 3 a.m. anyways I'm gonna make my soup but I'm actually gonna sign this vlog off here freaking picked a spot again that's so annoying I'm sorry if it's been really boring but give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and I will see you tomorrow in a vlog that was filmed a couple of days ago then I'll see you the day after for a vlog from Sheffield. <laughs> Bye!